Welcome to Strategies for Savings webinar presented by Alterna Savings. We hope this webinar will help you find ways to do more than just make ends meet and show you ways to get a little more out of your hard-earned dollar. You may be asking yourself, why is it important to save? When you save, you will feel more secure and in control, be better prepared for emergencies, reduce stress and conflict in your life, be able to spend with less guilt or fear, be able to afford major purchases, have the ability to pay off old debt and avoid new debt, be able to retire more comfortably. Without savings goals, you'll likely have a hard time saving money. We recommend that you be specific about what you're saving for a trip, reducing debt, retirement, etc. Set a realistic dollar amount and deadline. Lofty goals are good, but often discouraging when circumstances change. Break down larger goals into smaller, bite-sized pieces. Achieving several smaller goals keeps the momentum going and makes you feel like you're moving forward rather than beating against something much bigger. Write your goals down and post it wherever you can see it every day so you don't lose focus on it and it's always top of mind. Getting rid of debt and saving for a rainy day is a good example of a vague, non-specific goal. You should write down the amount of debt you want to reduce, the amount you want to save, and the date by when you want to achieve this goal. Then, ask yourself if it's realistic and suits your circumstances and current situation. For instance, an achievable goal might be to eliminate credit card debt of $1,600 and build an emergency fund of $2,000 by saving $3,600 by the end of December 2011. Breaking the amount down into smaller bites into saving $200 per month or $100 per pay makes the commitment less painful and gives you a higher chance of success. It's easy to keep stalling on saving. The time to do it is now. Most people feel they need to earn more money or have shorter months to be able to save. Often the money runs out before the month does. Is it possible to save without making more money? Yes. Really? So what's the secret? There's no secret, just a bit of knowledge and effort. Here are a few ways you can get started building your savings. Pay yourself first. Treat savings like a recurring bill you must pay each month. Automate your savings. Save 5% to 10% of your take home pay. Do you have extra money from gifts, tax returns, overtime, or a raise? Save it. Create an emergency fund. Typically, this should be three to six months of take-home pay. Don't rely on credit cards or lines of credit. And leave the money to grow. Get the best compound interest rate you can. Find the easy money. Avoid late fees, interest charges on late bills, parking tickets, and overcharges on your cell phone. And do you really use all of your mobile minutes or need a data plan on your cell phone? What about all those unwatched channels in your cable package? Money can be easy to find when you really start looking. Get creative. Every choice comes with a cost. Should you go out for a fancy dinner with friends or coffee and dessert? Why not do a potluck dinner at home instead? Take advantage of free. Share movies, books, CDs with a friend, or visit the library. Did you know they carried movies? Why buy to watch once? Buy smarter. Outlet malls are now offering designer clothing at discount prices. Do you really need designer pajamas and underwear? If the average price of a cup of coffee is $1.30 and 
and you purchase a cup every day for a year, did you know it would cost you over $400 for the year? Make your coffee at home and take along a travel mug instead. You'll be saving money and helping the environment at the same time. Take your own bags or bins when grocery shopping. Buy in bulk when possible and reduce convenience and snack foods. Cook big and freeze the leftovers for lunches and quick dinners. You'll save both money and time. Reduce energy costs by air drying clothes, shutting off computers when they're not in use, turn down the heat a couple of degrees and wear sweaters, turn off the lights when no one's in the room. Are you heating unused portions of your home? Consider downsizing which should reduce all of your costs. Mortgage, taxes, heating, insurance, and so on. Just like the Earth's resources, yours are limited. You need to plan how to use them more efficiently. Make sure you have the right checking account package. If you are a heavy transaction user, consider the unlimited transaction package. Or, if you only make occasional transactions, you may benefit from a smaller package. This is a great opportunity to speak with us. We can set you up with the right package that suits your needs. Avoid frequent ATM and Interact transactions. A good budget will keep you on track. Avoid white label ATMs. Check out the Exchange Network for locations in your area. Alterna Savings members have access to over 2,300 surcharge-free ATMs nationwide. We've come to the end of our webinar, and we thank you for your participation. We hope you found these tips useful and that they'll help you build your savings. We're here to help. To learn more about savings, visit one of our branches today. Visit alterna.ca or call one 877-560-0100 for branch locations. Thank you.